It's been five years since the first therapy dog, Buddy the Mini Golden Doodle, started walking the halls in a Fenton area public school. Now the district has six therapy dogs and they plan to add more. The staff calls it a needed program because many students have anxiety. Here are four of the six, Buddy, Bella, Simon, and Sunny. They spend their days with kids and teachers, and each has their own job. So Bella here is a service dog in our autism classroom. So Todd is our, Todd, Mr. Schroeder is our handler, but uh, Mr. Schroeder hands Bella off to the classroom, and those students have jobs for Bella. Todd Schroeder teaches at Fenton High School. He says Bella knows every day when they turn into the school that it's time to work. She works with students with autism, helping them learn responsibility and communication. Speak properly, clearly. Use your words when you speak to the dog, commands. Um, just responsibly just take them for walks. So they take the dog out for a walk on a bad day, or they need anxiety, so the kids just need a walk, they take the dog out just for a five minute walk and it calms them down to get ready back to the educational learning. Barry Tiemann is the Director of Communications and Innovation for the district. Five years ago, he advocated for a therapy dog. That's when Buddy entered the district. At the time, Tiemann was an elementary school principal. A local school south of us had had programs, so I contacted them and did a lot of research and talking with them first to, to really know that it would actually be an effective program for the school district and from there um, kind of piloted it and the, the results were phenomenal. While many kids are excited to see the dogs, they never force anyone to pet or be with a dog. We don't ever expect a student to, to feel comfortable, so we will give them as much space as they need and as much time as they need uh, to feel comfortable. At the high school, the dogs greet students as they walk into the building. When they expanded their program to three dogs, Tiemann says he didn't know what to expect. They're, you know, too cool for school, uh, but they, they, they really just benefit, I think, just as much or more because uh, their level of anxiety is different than an elementary student, so they, they really benefited from this experience. Right now, they are looking to add two more dogs to the district. Each school fundraises or gets support from local businesses to pay for the dog and necessary training.